there. I mean, uh, one week from today, you'll be taking the field for an actual game. Or you feel like you guys are ready for that? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, we've had a good camp. Um, both sides of the ball, special teams, too, have, have done a good job of competing. Um, you know, the culture of our program, I feel like it's shifting a little bit to where, you know, even freshmen are coming in and, and trying to take jobs, and, you know, and be superstars. So, um, you know, I think we're getting there in this last week of practice. I think we're going to go in, focus, replenish, and, you know, and be ready to, ready to compete on Saturday. Expand on that a little bit, culture shift. Uh, when did you kind of start to notice it? This camp, this spring, this summer? Um, I think it's just, I think it's been a gradual thing. Um, that's that's kind of built up over time, just with the the guys, including myself, the older guys have a certain type of personality about them. Um, we go about things a certain type of way, and I think that's that's kind of bleeding into the, the younger guys and, and, and making our program come across a certain type of way. Um, you know, we're, we're confident in ourselves, but we also understand that there's work to be done. Um, you know, I think I think we're a real humble team for, you know, we got in Jared and Keyshawn, you know, two national superstars. Um, so, and, and no one's going around saying, look at me. Uh, we're not that type of team. So, you know, we're, we're, I think we're doing the little things right. So we're, we're excited to see how we, we turn out. How did you feel those quarterbacks competed this fall going for that number one job? I mean, I, I was, I think it was a great competition. I'm excited. I mean, I think like I've always said, both either, either of them can play. Um, I think that, you know, if you watch us practice, if you watch them practice, and if you watch them like from spring up until now, they've both gotten better. And I think that's be that's in part due to the other person. And, uh, you know, and just continue to push it, knowing that they can't slack off because there's somebody, you know, right behind them. How much have you delved into the Georgia defense at all? Um, I'll be honest, uh, we, we, we started watching a, a few DB cutups. Mm -hmm. um, not not too too much. Uh, but you, I mean, you played those guys in years past. Yeah, for me, I mean personally, I've I've just I dedicated my summer to you know learning defenses overall, so that you know there's only so many defenses the team can run. So um, once I once I see their DBs and you know see who's returning for sure, and, and kind of I guess by Tuesday I, I have a good feel for who I need to watch and you know what I'm looking for. Last question. I mean, do you sense the guys are just ready for that game? Sick of fall camp, sick of going against one another? Of course, man. I think there's, a, I think, but I think that's the best part about fall camp. You go, to, you go against each other and prepare each other, and by the end of it, you're like, man, I want to play somebody else. I'm tired of seeing, you know, these guys, my guys have got me better, but I want to test my skills against somebody else now. And I think that's what, you know, the anticipation is kind of, you know, at an all-time high. So uh, next Saturday, I think we're gonna come out here and be fired up and ready to play.